Good morning. And good morning, everybody. It is currently Thursday. Just woke up. Looking pretty nice out there. Gonna go for a quick gym sesh with Flint, which I am still in time for, which is good. Um, and then gonna go have coffee, and then gonna go have lunch, and then gonna come back, do some editing, do some work, and uh, that's about the day. So, stay tuned. We'll see you very soon. I wonder if I'll ever actually use that transition. I have no idea. Anyway. <sighs> yeah. Let's go. Yo! Let's go! Sun is out. The birds are chirping. The day has begun. This is awesome. Look at that. Okay, come on, focus, mate. Anyway, sky is blue. Let's go. Let's go. It is a wee bit chilly. Look at the frost on this bad boy. Sheesh. Don't know if you could see that, but there was a little bit. There was a little bit. Winter is coming. Um, hell yeah. Oh. She a bit frosty. It's a bit chilly in this boy, man. Oh, I don't even, oh, my blankets are in the back. Oh, no, <laughs> it's gonna be cold. God, oh, man. I was talking with one of my friends the other day. I was saying, oh, I don't know. We are just, we're just so weird. I'm just so weird. Allow it. <laughs> anyway. Um, guys, I've been really, over the last couple of days, thinking about doing an immersion. Um, I don't know what has really sparked it, but I just have this urge to go out, gain experience, and give back. Um, because there are so many people that aren't as fortunate as, as I am. And I would love to be able to contribute something in some way. Um, I have got a couple of ideas for it, so I think that I will hold on to those for now. But, uh, yeah. I don't know. Anyway. Let's go to the gym. Yo, so guys, I'm in the car park now. Not gonna lie, today I'm feeling pretty tired. Um, stayed up quite late last night. I'm not even sure what I was doing. Um, transferring videos, trying to figure out storage. <laughs> Just, yeah, anyway. Um, editing some stuff and, you know, just that kind of, kind of, action um anyway so here we are at the gym just got in the car park waiting for Flynn to get here he could possibly already be here I'm not sure I'm also starving I really think that I could um go for a feed but that's okay I didn't really feel like a meat so early in the morning um, <laughs> and I also only like kept hitting snooze with my alarm which was not a good good start to the day unfortunately that's just how it is sometimes um but that's okay because we're on to bigger and better things um and the day started and i'm really really freaking excited to get going um i'm really really keen to build up a little bit more of my my own personal social um and my personal brand it's something that I really need to focus on um, because it's going to bring in a lot more work for me, but it's also just going to bring me more opportunities, I think, and able to make, no, and make it, apologies, let me start again. It's going to bring in more opportunities, and it's just going to give me a bit more of a chance to express myself and share content that I want to be sharing and meet people, opportunities, and places and have experiences that I want to be having um, which is really important to me so that's what we're gonna get going um, sorry look at the screen um, 
anyway, that's what we're going to get going, and that's okay. But I just need to figure out exactly what that looks like. I've got a couple of ideas. Um, yeah. But anyway, right now we're at the gym, and then we're going to lunch with my mate Tom, and then we're going to, yeah, do some work and get back to it. I'm pretty sure tomorrow... Tomorrow I think I'm having a chill, chill morning. Hell yeah, might go and get... Anyway, it doesn't matter about tomorrow. We're here today right now, we're here today. So let's go. Oh. Hell yeah, man. I'm feeling, I sound a little bit sick. I don't like that. I really don't like that. Anyway, we digress. Yo, there's a decent amount of cars in here today. Hectic. Gym, lifting some 20 kilos, just like that. Easy work. Flint's in the mirror. <laughs> Can I zoom in? There we go. No, it's, it's literally a vlog. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh. Light work, baby. Alright, we're ready. Yo, Flint, give us a review first time in Red Well, uh, it's a nice spot. I, uh, Usually into CrossFit, but this is, this is where it's at. This is, <laughs> this is where it's at. Go on, keep going. Mate, if I'm in front of the camera, I just keep <laughs> So all my vlogs are like 55 minutes long. I'm like, shh. As we're just here doing plate, plate push for our chest, trying to get big chest. Um, hashtag Snowy Lifts for inspiration. Even though I told him everything he knows. Let's go, Flynn. Let's go. Let's go. Hola. <laughs> no. Sheesh. Look at the size of that guy. Let's go. Nice, Flynn. Get the shrugs going. Yeah, nice, Slim. Your back looks huge, mate. <laughs> huge. Yeah, a little bit of a stretch in there. I like it. And now we're on. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Oh, peachy. Jeepers. Nice work. <laughs> we need to go down next time. <laughs> Yeah, it's getting yeah. heavy. Yeah. That, that one, that was, that was too heavy. <laughs> oh. She, you know, we're filming that type of content. Let's go. Nicely. Sheesh. Nicely done. Nicely done. Nice, Flynn. Looking good, mate. Let's go. Go on, give me a little smile there. <laughs> <laughs> Not really a smile, but... Yeah, you guys, people come up. Looking good. 
animal. Well, this guy's Superman because he's flying. Let's go. <laughs> that is an awesome acre. Good friend. Quick review? Yeah, honestly, I'm, I'm out of here, dude. That's fucking brutal. That's all. That's You just can't help yourself. Can't uh, look at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what is up, guys? I just got back home from our gym session coffee. I, I don't know. I just absolutely love spending time with Flynn. So I was so grateful for that time that he gave me this morning. For all the conversation for the great gym sesh um yeah i don't know it's i feel so energized and just so alive and just so just good right now which is awesome and it's exactly how you want to feel when you leave hanging out with one of your friends um so i just got home and then a package from windsor smith was here so got these bad boys which um i'm gonna do something interesting with make a couple of videos do some photos and then these ones um which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, it's just so weird that this is stuff that's happening to me now. <laughs> um, got a couple more packages coming today as well, hopefully, according to the clients, which was nice. So yeah, excited to see what comes from those. Um, but yeah, for now, gonna have a shower, have another coffee, and sit down, do some work before going to pick up Tom and going for lunch. So yeah, let's do it. You. <laughs> Guys, here's my um. Ooh. Yo, that is so sick. Ready? No, okay. Yo, that's that was pretty cool. Uh, anyway, here's my um my coffee mug. I made this bad boy almost a year ago at a pottery studio with one of my friends down south. Which was really cool. Um, anyway, uh, drink out of it every morning. I really want to have a house filled with like stuff like this that I've made. Um, I think that would just be beautiful. Filled with photos that I've taken, art that I've made, and pottery. <laughs> Having a pottery studio would be so sick. I actually really want to go and do pottery again somewhere in Perth. I was thinking of doing a course for it, just at TAFE, just for fun. But, I'm not sure. Maybe. Lots of different things, lots of different potentials on my mind at the moment of what we could be doing and where we're going next. So it's exciting. Um, hope you guys are having a really good day. I'm having a brilliant day. I'm feeling so alive. I find myself thinking that all the time these days. I just feel so alive, so aligned with exactly where I want to be going and with my direction and with my purpose. And it is awesome. It's incredible. And I want other people to feel this. And I think that for me, it's come from initially having this want to be better and do better and find direction and do all these things and then it's come through this group of people who I've always felt alone and then I found these people and a community that is the same as me and they all want the same things they're all pushing for the same things and it is incredible and I've just never felt so like this and I've been out of focus that whole time but that is so fine man anyway <laughs> um yeah, so it just feels, it feels incredible. It feels incredible to just be here and be alive. And why does it keep doing that, man? Anyway, um, I don't want to be able to share that. So if anyone has any thoughts or, or concerns or things that they want to work on, like I would absolutely love to be a part of that. Um, I think cold nips is going to be a huge part of where I want to go moving forward. Um, I want to get a lot more into that space and just and bring different 
ideas and, and, and things into practice and just make a difference because I think that everyone deserves to feel the way that I'm feeling right now and I just want to share that with everyone. So, you know, it's exciting and it's fun and I'm just absolutely McLovin' it, you know? Anyway, okay, um, what am I doing now? I'm gonna finish this coffee and then my room's a little bit, getting a little bit messy. I don't know why. I feel like the last couple of days, it's just been really messy. And I've always been someone that keeps everything very, very tidy. Um, yeah, I'm just doing a little bit of editing on some videos before I go and pick up my mate for, for lunch. Um, and then I've got some videos to edit, which I'm so keen to get on. And then tomorrow, I don't know if I've got anything. I don't know if I've got work. Yes, I do. I've got more products coming today. And I've got these shoes. And I've got about four, four or five production plans I need to make. Which will be good. So hopefully, I'll just have a day at home just doing what I'm doing. So it might be a bit of a boring vlog tomorrow. Vlog? Oh, that's sick. It might be a bit of a boring vlog tomorrow, but no, it won't be because we'll do something in the evening. And I'll probably go for coffee in the morning. Maybe see Thomas, which will be fun. Yeah, man. Day in the life. Let's do it. I'm so full of energy right now. I'm just so full of energy right now. So aligned, feeling so good. All I want to do is learn and read and just take everything in and create and explore and make money and travel. And oh, it's so exciting. I feel like I'm finally taking control. And it is the most incredible feeling ever. And I really hope that every single person out there can see this and be like, you know what? Look at this guy. Look at how energized he is. Look at how happy he's fucking feeling. And like, Take inspiration from that because I want to share that with you. You know, that's the reason I'm doing this stuff. I want to share and I want you guys to experience this. And my dogs keep barking. I need to go and see what's going on. But I hope that you guys get the message and I hope that maybe you can take something away from some of my stuff. I'll definitely be posting a lot more because um, I want to share this. This is what I want to be doing. So, yeah, cheers, team. Yo, okay, so you're currently in my bathroom and I've just put on a face mask. Oh yeah, get a nice close up of that. Pretty cool. Oh, yeah, mirror selfie, let's go. Um, Cause my skin, oh, look, I love having a face mask on. I love, I used to be part of my routine where I'd um, have a shower in the evening after the gym, put on a face mask, make a tea and write in my journal. And so that was my every night routine. Um, so I absolutely loved it. My skin was going really, really good. And I found like probably three or four weeks ago, I stopped, I got out of my routine. I stopped journaling, I stopped looking after my skin, I started eating a little bit worse. Um, and like just, there's a difference between enjoying yourself and, and eating what you want to be eating and then being overindulgent. And I think I was a little bit overindulgent in sugary foods. I got quite addicted to sugar again, um, which is something that I wasn't, well, I haven't been addicted to in a very long time. So that was, yeah, so my skin basically went to, to, to poop. Um, and now, we're just getting back onto it. I've already noticed the difference with the, in the new diet. Um, my skin has gone so much better. My routine's getting back on track and like, I just feel better. Um, but, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that I'm putting the face mask on and that for all you blokes out there that probably haven't done it or aren't really sure or think it's a weird, like, I felt the same way at the start. I wasn't really sure, but I was open to it. And I think when you're open to, to learning new things and trying new things, you really, you can't lose. Like you just, oh, that light's not good. You just become a lot more <clears throat> willing to accept life as it is and, and try new things. And that's how I've like, discovered so many of the best things that are, like the things that I hold most dearest is just trying new things and being open to it. So, if you want your skin to feel freaking amazing, um, go and invest in a really good skincare. Because when you're looking good, like when you, when you feel good and you're taking care of yourself, you start to look better. You start to feel better. You start to get more confident. You start to just just you feel good. You feel light. You feel free. Smiles are easier. You look people in the eyes for longer. You stand up straighter. Like really. That confidence is so worth the discomfort of this first time going to a shop and be like, oh shit, I don't know, I don't know what to get, I don't know what to buy, oh, I don't know how to use this. It is so worth it. So that's just a little PSA from me to you. Um, 
But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna get changed and then I'm gonna head, not yet, I'm gonna do some more editing and then I'm gonna head over to see Thomas. Well, and we're back. Um, got this, got the fit, white pants as usual, gonna rock the Burks, going for lunch. Um, got this sick shirt from Fish Clothing, which is some WA boys, uh, which we love to see and we love to support that. So, yeah, just gonna go now and pick Thomas up. I am starving. This will be my first meal of the day. Um, I had some straws a little bit earlier, which was a bit cheeky. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go somewhere that I'm actually not sure of, but apparently Thomas knows. So yeah, let's do it. I don't know if you'll get much film. I guess you'll find out in literally two seconds. <laughs> and that's that. Wow. That was meant to be a cool transition there, but maybe we'll just do it here. Or, nah, actually, let's do this one. Let's do this one. Ready? Just got back. Got another package from Beer Job, which is awesome. And they're using compostable zero waste bags. So that's what we like to see. Oh man, why have we been so. Yeah. Oh, it's because I've got the lock on, is it? I don't know, man. Whatever. <laughs> that is what it is. Man, it looks huge when it's like Oh, that is such a cool angle. <laughs> um, yep, so we're back in. Um, had a really, really nice lunch with Tom, um, which was awesome. And I feel really re energized after seeing him. And we had some like nice conversations. Like, it felt good having conversation that actually matters, um, which is a beautiful thing. So, yep, dogs. Completely ignored my presence as I walked in. Thank you. Thanks guys. Appreciate it. Sick. <laughs> um, but we're gonna come in and so we're gonna put these these ear jobs on charge so that we can start filming with it. I can test them out a little bit and then put a video together. And then I'm going to now drop off a package at one of my friends' houses, come back, do some washing and then sit down and edit for the rest of the day. Put some production plans together for a couple of companies. Um, so by production plan, I mean just like the style of the video, the kits that we're gonna wear, like the talent's gonna wear, the different talent's gonna be involved, the camera angles, the camera shots, what you're gonna see on screen, the scripting and all that kind of stuff. Um, which I like to make a practice of doing before every single shoot, especially when it's for a company or a brand. Um, because I like to have those things approved first as most most of content gigs that's what you're gonna do um, which is good because it actually gives me time to sit down and actually plan it out and align it with the brand strategies and stuff um, on smaller jobs like there is no time allowment for for that because of the amount that you're getting paid which is frustrating sometimes but I still manage to find the time to do it because it makes it so much easier in the filming and editing process because you've got everything sorted for you so you don't have to think about it. Um, but yes, super keen for that and I'll uh, keep you updated. Let's go. Hi gang, so now just dropped it off at the beach. Look at that. God damn gorgeous. Let's go. Oh man. It just feels so, so good to be alive right now. So good to be here and just mm, nice little toilet block in there. Here we are, Malu. So I just got back from dropping off the product and honestly, I'm feeling a little bit weird. Feeling a little bit weird. I've had a really good day. I feel like... Um, Today has been the first day that hasn't been really busy, but I still did a lot of stuff, but it felt just like stuff for me. And I don't know, it feels a bit weird. Um, I feel like I've had a little bit of stress creep up on me in the last couple of, like, minutes. Um, in that ride home, like, I didn't have the music on. I don't know. But I guess that happens with coming into something big or something new for you 
there is a little bit of stress and there's a little bit of doubt and I think that's normal. And I still feel very aligned with the direction I'm going. And I still know there's a lot of hard work to be put in and I'm so keen to do that. Um, I just... Yeah, there are lots of things that I'm going to have to navigate that are new, that I'm navigating right now that are new, which is exciting. But it's also a little bit scary. Um, and I'm not ashamed to admit that. And there are things that I'm not 100% certain of yet, which is okay. It feels good though, just to look at where I am right now and where I've come from. And like, Two years ago, my life was pretty different, which is pretty exciting. A year ago, my life was pretty different. Six months ago, my life was pretty different. Three months ago, my life was pretty different. And that's exciting. And I think right now, the only thing that is holding me back is my... Maybe there isn't anything. I don't know. I feel like I've just been sitting in the car for the last 10 minutes. Just sitting here. Oh well, time to get out. Let's go! <laughs> no use wasting all day. Got shit to do, man. Got, um, videos to edit. People to talk to. Money to collect. Got people to... Uh... Yeah, donation, no. People to get money from. <laughs> Um, videos to make and dreams to create which is exciting very exciting it's almost like I don't know what to do with myself properly which is a weird position because there's just so much opportunity but there's just so much guys I just filmed like 5 minutes of audio and none of it worked because my mic was turned off I need that to be charged ASAP. Okay, let's go. Anyway, yo, what is up guys? It is currently 9.20 and all I've done since last time I was updated was, oh, um, I never actually used that transition for a minute. Anyway, um, it's currently 9.20 and all I've done since we talked last has been edit. Just been editing videos, um, yeah, which has been fine. And now I'm just editing some photos, as you can see there. Got a pretty good one there of George looking pretty pretty good um, from our shoot the other day. But my sister's came out home from work, and so she's bought me a fortune cookie. And so I know that you're not meant to do this, but I'm going to. You're going to, um, that was a big crumb. I don't like eating in my room. And I've always told people off eating in my room. But, I'm going to have to use this bad boy as a plate. Alright, there we go. You guys can read it before I do. What does it say? I'll tell ya. Smile five times a day to gain positive energy every day. Boom. And there you go. So, take that into your day today. Smile five times to bring in some positive energy. Hell yeah. Yeah, good cookie. Oh no. I just forgot I was doing the carny diet. This is delicious. Right. Wow. It's only six grams. <laughs> we'll survive. And yeah guys, that's it. That's the plan. That's all we've done. Um, I'm gonna keep editing and hopefully get these bad boys done. That'll be awesome. Well, I need to get these ones done. Then I've got to do two production plans. Which will be interesting. Hopefully I get those done. Well, I have to, so.
Let's go. Okay. Yo, so I know that I'm probably, well, that I am so late to this party, but, um, Lightroom is, oh my goodness. Lightroom is so clutch. I never understood how good it was to edit your photos, like how much difference that made. And like, yeah, sometimes I don't get it quite right. And like, I'm definitely learning still, like, oh, I see some ones I edited like, like maybe two months ago and how saturated they are. And I thought they looked good, but like, look at now, obviously I can tell. Um, and I'm sure in another six months or another month, I'll look at these ones and go, holy shit, that looks terrible. But it's also really cool that I've been able to, um, anyway, it's been so sick, like just learning that and also working in RAW, never done that before. And like, this was the first shoot that I actually did it in RAW and like, oh my God, it made such a difference, man. Open. So I got so distracted there. Um, yeah, I'm never not shooting in RAW again. That was incredible. Took up so much more space though. But that's okay. And now, just about to teach myself how to use Photoshop. Guys, I'm really just coming into my era. This is so exciting to me. All right, anyway, this will probably be the last one. So I'll probably say good night now. Hopefully you'll have a wonderful night. Well, a wonderful day. Um, whatever day it is, hopefully this is soon, like it's currently the 25th. If this isn't out by the 30th, oh man, I'm going to be so disappointed in myself. Um, yeah, that's a good plan. Get it out by the 30th. Now there's a deadline. Let's go. Alright, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a wonderful day.